Hello, welcome back, and today I'm going to try something different. I want to start my, like, worst game series, where I, like, play through a game, and it'd be like a game that people would say is not a very good game, or a very fun game, and I thought about just starting to play through some of these, and just to see, you know, like, what my, like, like what I think about the game, or, you know, if I think it's as bad as what people say. Now this one is uh, Dark Ca uh, James Cameron's Dark Angel for the original Microsoft Xbox. And I remember when it came out that a lot of people said it wasn't very good or it had mixed reviews. Kind of like mediocre reviews. And I played through it a, a really long time ago. Uh, maybe a year or two after it came out. And I know it's based off of a television show the same name. James Cameron's Dark Angel, and I thought I would just play through it again and see how well it aged or if it's any good anymore. So I'll go ahead and start a new game. And I'll just play it on hard. I want to try to get through it. I mean, I'm not familiar with it anymore, but, you know, maybe I can beat it. Cause I had beat it in the past. I think it was on hard. Okay, let's see. Locate the lumber yard to reach West Central Seattle. Avoid capture by the I Corporation Asset Recovery Team. Yeah, I'll just see how good I do at this game. Remember the controls were kind of clunky. this being like a stealthy type game. I guess the L trigger crouches. The right stick moves the camera. I don't remember what the controls are.
the X button punches and then the Y button does like a grapple or heavier attack. Though I don't think that was the correct way I could have done that. I think I could have used stealth. See what this is. Max, I've hacked into their comm system. Someone from I Corporation is mobilizing troops to catch you, and it sounds like they know roughly where you are, so watch out for traps. The sector you're in is swarming with troops. Do your best to avoid them. Be careful, Mac. Okay, I think I have to avoid these spotlights. They saw me, though. After this fight, I'm going to pause it to see if I can find out what the controls are. Controller. Okay, the supervision is the right button, and action is the black button. Crouch sneak is L. Fight target lock is R. Okay, I need grapple. I already need punch. Jump is B. Kick is A. The D pad does. Deactivate inventory, cycle inventory, activate in inventory. Speed burst if I click the left stick. Which I don't see anything about. Like, um, stealth attacks or anything. Transmission would be the same thing again. I need you at my hanging ladders allow you to gain access to upper levels in the area. Keep an eye out for them. stealth gun. It's a weapon designed to stun hard to reach enemies such as snipers. Use this weapon primarily on elevated enemies as its limited ammunition capability is very valuable. See there's guys down there. It's like three of them. I don't know why he's talking about that gun. Guess I can't jump over that. Might whoa. I'm saying if I probably get caught by that, guys will come out after me. I think I can use this. Okay, the guy saw me. I'm 
gonna say the first time I played through this, it wasn't like too much stealth you could do. These guys seem like they have a lot of health, but probably because I'm playing on hard. Use these to your advantage. Look for stacks of gas barrels in the immediate area when you find a lighter and make your own. Says so use lighters on gas tanks to make an exit. I think he's talking about this. But I want to see what's down here first. It's like, I wonder if that's a health pack. Here's something. Now let me try to use a slider. And then run away. Oh, there's like a bunch of guys. I guess, like, I don't think you could really do stealth because when I blew up the barrels, these guys came running out. I don't know how hard this game is or if it gets harder later, but I, I know I beat this game and I'm pretty sure I beat it on hard mode. And at some point, I remember using, like, stealth attacks to take out some of the enemies, but probably not all of them. I mean, the controls aren't too bad, like, I can just run and it's responsive. And the camera, like this, the right stick controls the camera. I mean, overall, the, the controls feel pretty decent. So I don't think the game lacks there. Okay, I was going to answer that, but it went away. Maybe if I run back here, it'll it'll come back up again. I guess not. So now I like to know what that said. Cause it might be something I need to know. I guess it's not going to uh, come back up again. Looks like I use a keypad again. more guys to fight. Oh, now he's got a weapon. Oh, 
I'm gonna end up dying in a minute. Cause these enemies just got really tough. I think that takes care of him, hopefully, and I hope I have a health pack or this is the end of the level, either one, because I'm about dead. inventory. I need health. It says stealth gun but I don't know how to use it. Okay I got health. I have a stealth gun. I guess that's how you use it. Okay I'm dying. Because I can't get the stealth gun off of me. Okay, I died. Because, maybe. Let's see. Because I selected the stealth gun and I didn't know how to deselect it. I'm dying again. Let me punch him. Great, I died. Hopefully sh there's checkpoints in this game. I'm afraid it's going to start me all the way back at the beginning. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> if I crouch and I push the Y button, it'll do a stealth attack. So that's helpful to know. So hopefully I don't get seen. Well, because these guys take forever to beat up. He's gonna tell me the same thing. Yeah, key cards. Okay, so one of those guys should have gave me a key card. I'm gonna use it. This next area, I'm gonna try to use stealth. That's if I don't get seen again. I tried to use stealth, it didn't work because he saw me. Hanging ladders allow you to gain access to upper levels. Okay, I heard that one. 
I just need to know what the other one said after this area. Grab that. I think that's health pack. I need you at my apartment. I've received a message for you through my online network. If the message is accurate, this is important. Hurry, there isn't much time. Try this again. Maybe. Actually, I got the stuff gun. I want to see. Okay, you select it and then you move it around with the uh, left stick. And I don't want to shoot it, which I'm sure it's probably the X button. But I need to deselect it. So I push down. I select it again, it didn't do anything. I'm not quite sure how you deselect it. Let's see. Okay. The white button deselects it. Let me try it one more time. I select it with the A button and then the Y button, or not the Y, but the white button deselects it. He's telling me about the uh, stealth gun. It's a weapon designed to stun hard to reach enemies such as snipers. Use this weapon primarily. It's used for mostly snipers. I'm gonna go back here, grab this. And then I'm gonna go out this door. are after me already. I do like how when you f grab them, you can toss them into someone else. Gotta see why he oh yeah, he's gonna tell me about the lighter. I already know that. I wanna go down here and get this health pack. I think there's two of them. Then I want to blow up uh, these barrels with the lighter. So I select the lighter, push the A button, get out of here. Some guys come out. See, he runs straight to me, so there was no hiding absolutely from that. He just exactly knew where I was going to be. I was hoping if I hid they wouldn't know, but so I guess this fight's like unavoidable.
Yeah, I'm still good on health for right now. Takes care of them. Looks like I got the next key card I needed. Here's where I need to find out what the guy was gonna tell me. Tonfa's are a girl's best friend, Max. Strap these on and you can take out some sector police quick and easy. Tonfa's? Okay. I have those. Somewhere I did have them. Right there they are. Let me see what those do. Maybe that's why I needed. I lost the fight the last time because I didn't have these equipped. Okay, they're, they're like weapons, like melee weapons. Okay, use the card. I go through here. She still got the melee weapons on. Here's some health packs. Okay, this is that cutscene. I'm gonna skip it since I've already watched it. Okay, this this makes fighting faster. I've got to take the guy out with the gun first. Try to anyway. Okay. Okay. He's just taking me down. Like. My melee weapon's gone. Make sure, yeah. I guess it, it's like limited. Okay, what's he gonna say this time? Looks like I can may be able to run or fight. I will try to fight them. Take him out first because he's a shooter. He's a health pack. Can't get shot at again because he's over here shooting me. Down. Health pack. Okay, the shooter's still alive. Okay. Trying to take him out first, but then he'll like get knocked away from me and then. I think he's finally gone. Push down, I gotta use another health pack. Basically just mash with the X button a lot and occasionally the Y button. The faster I mash it, the better I've been doing. One thing is, like, let me use the health that I don't know if I like is, like, when I'm attacking, like, you can't move with, like, the directional stick. So, like, you have to fin wait till the punch is finished and then move. Which, like, sometimes I'll start attacking before I, like, like, am close enough to actually punch them. I think that yeah, he's done. He's dead. 
I've used a lot of whoa. Okay, I use a lot of health packs. And uh took those guys out. Got further this time than I did the last time. I don't see any items except for over here. I could use those. I want to say I have to blow these up. My luck, there's going to be some guys pour out. Here's a guy, okay. Get the fists on. Attack them. Actually, I gotta use a health. I'm gonna use two health packs. So I'm gonna need the health. Maybe. Like I said earlier, like I haven't played this game in years and I only played it like played through it once and then I don't remember much about it like as I play through it I start to remember like what the levels look like but like I'm not an expert at this at all and I have it on hard so I just wanted to play through it again on hard so I don't have to play it again so I can just be finished with it I remember not being a very long game. Like you could beat it fairly or like fast, maybe like five or six hours. See that's one way. I don't know if there was another way or another area. I don't think you can go that way, so I guess it's the only way I can go. I think that's it. Okay, save. I'll save it to the hard disk. Save one. Yes. And continue. So that's one level done. Locate the marketplace and find a way inside. Expect a large concentration of forces around the marketplace. Yeah, I've never watched this show before, though. I kind of wanted to watch it, but I don't think it was on for very long. So I think a lot of people, there were some fans of it, and I think it, was a, it would probably be a pretty good show. Okay, so basically I think it wants me to use stealth. Because he says it's too many of them to fight. I'm just going to look around make sure I don't miss any items. There's a guy. Okay. Yes, I want to use stealth. I just don't want to get caught. So, like, if one guy, I need to wait for these two guys to be facing opposite directions. Take him out. Hide. Actually, I could probably grab him too. Grab this stuff, and I'll go take this guy out down here, avoiding these spotlights. I don't know if they can hear my footsteps or not. I feel like you don't see me. 
Gotta get out of this light. Okay. There's a guy. He was looking towards me, but maybe because I wasn't close. I like stealth instead of having to fight him outright. It's quicker that way. Max, according to my map, the only way through to the east side of town is through the old marketplace. I'm running a check on what kind of forces are set up around the facility. It seems pretty quiet. I'd be cautious. Something doesn't feel right. Hope you don't see me. Well, they saw me. Try to find them, I guess. As long as it's just these two guys, it won't be too bad. Okay, so the B button does some kind of like flip attack. Okay, I'm on a countdown. I don't know what that means. So I don't know if it means that I need to beat these guys within the, the time allowed and more guys are coming. I did beat him, I think, right before the timer ended. Did you use the key card? more of this tonfa, whatever it is. It looks like backup came. Gotta take him out first. That's all of them guys. Hopefully that's all of them. Which I think maybe that timer was back up coming. So I blow those barrels up or something. Another health pack. It's another one. So I guess it's lighter time. I get away from it. I guess no matter where I stand, if guys come out, they're gonna find me. Yep. Okay, I think I'm out of those tonfo things. So I guess you can't use stealth on these guys. I always kind of found silly. It's like some games will let you stealth, but only in certain spots. And then there's some spots you just can't, you know, no matter what, you have to fight the guys out. I'm doing pretty good on health right now. It's just these guys have a lot of health.
Okay, that's all the guys. Okay, it's lighter time again. Okay, I think I got the hang of this game now. Like, I got all the controls down. Because, uh, you know, it's all coming back to me what I'm supposed to be doing. Okay, that's that level's done. I'm gonna save it. To the hard disk, just in case anything goes wrong. I'm going to just go ahead and overwrite. Actually, I'll just alternate saves. Just in case. So I'm playing with the big Xbox controller to the Duke. I guess as people call it. Acquiring the key card for the exit undetected is your best bet here, Max. Kinda like it better than the uh the S controller. Just cause I like the placement of the black and white button a little better. So this is the third stage. Um, if I remember correctly, the stages aren't really all that long. There's a sector captain guarding the exit of the facility. It's your only way out. Try and sneak up on him and take him out. You should have the exit key. Stay out of sight. And Max, if you do get seen, you'll have just a few seconds before reinforcements arrive. Okay, I'm gonna try to take this guy out with stealth. And maybe this guy. Once this light goes past me, take him out. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. That thing was almost about ready to spot me, and it did. So all these guys are coming after me. And I got a timer again. At this point, I don't know if I should just restart the level or continue, but I'll see what happens here. I think that when the timer runs out, I might get a mission over if I don't get the guys beat by then. Fourteen seconds left. I think he was the last one, this guy. Okay, I can't do enough damage to him. Yep, I think the mission is over if he can't beat the guys fast enough. I tried. At least I was at the beginning, so I don't have to back, you know, do the same thing over again. I just gotta make sure that spotlight don't see me this time. Okay, he's gonna talk again. I don't need to hear it. Okay, this guy's right here. Take him down. Okay, wait for this guy to turn around. Watch out for the spotlight. Take him out. 
Okay. There's a guy walking in front of me. Okay, he saw me. Here I go. I'll try to beat these guys again, but I don't know if I could do it. Yeah, I might as well just restart. Because I can't beat these guys. I can't beat those guys fast enough before the timer runs out. I just really have to try not to get seen. Okay, I'm gonna try this again. Take him out before the light comes around. Okay, go back this way. There's a guy over there. I don't want him to see me. Okay, so... Oh. He saw me. Well, cause I... I didn't know how close I could actually get to him without having to crouch. So I wanted to do it quick enough. If I could just beat these guys really fast. They got the health bar so much. They got so much health. This guy's about dead. He's dead. He's gone. Okay, come on. I got 30 seconds. I think he's dead. He's the last guy, I don't know. He's got so much health though. So. Yeah, I'm not gonna get it. Oh, just barely, barely missed it. Oh man. Don't worry, I can get it this time. I just have to be more careful with the guys not being like letting them see me. Okay, I'll skip all this stuff. Great work. Okay, I'll wait for this guy. As soon as he turns, I'll grab him. Okay, take him down. For him to go. Don't get seen by the light. Take him out. Okay, go back in here. Wait for that guy. Okay. Run a little bit. Crouch. Take him out. Come on. Don't see me light. No! I'm just going to restart it. I have an idea. 
Might work, might not. Okay, clear this out. Don't need to hear that guy again. Take him down. I think a lot of this is me not having enough patience because I'm just... I'm trying to get through the game quickly as I can, but I was going to have to take my time. I think if I wait here, he can't see me. As soon as he turns, I can maybe get him. No. I'm not even trying it because that light. It would came back before I could take him down. But this time, as soon as he turns, I should be able to go get after him. Take him down right now. Okay, get out of here. Okay. This guy... Okay. I need to wait for him. I mean, if I could take down maybe this guy, and if I did get seen, I think I should be able to beat the other guys up. My worry is this light. I just can't. I have to hurry up and get out of the way. Okay. Whew. Okay, the light belt got me, and that guy almost saw me. Well, that's not good. I forgot about the light behind me. Well, I think I can get this now. Not the way I wanted to do it, but it'll work. It'd be nice to be able to play and do the all stealth as much as possible. He's dead. He's got a lot of health, but I got 40 seconds left. Okay, come on. I can take him out. Okay, he dropped the passcode. Timer's gone, and I'm back back in business again. I think that should have been all the enemies. So it's over here. Okay, if you click the um, right stick, it recenters the camera. Okay, I'll use the keypad. Or the key card. I don't know if anybody's in here. Nope. That's it. That's the level. That wasn't too bad. I'm go ahead and save the game. I'll save it in the next slot so that way, just in case anything ever happened. Okay, continue. I-Corp forces are moving into the sector near your apartment, Max. Based on the actions that they've been demonstrating, chances are roadblocks are going up all over the rest of Seattle. Whoever's running this operation really wants you in their hands. Get to your apartment as quickly as possible and I'll work out our next move in the meantime. Okay, I think I want to stop the video right here, and I'll pick it up again later. Um, so far, I'm not having a too bad a time on hard difficulty. I remember the game not ever really being too hard, except for there's like one part towards the end I had trouble with. Um, but I think the game's alright so far. It's just kind of, you know, a little mediocre maybe. It's not like terrible, but I think it's playable. And I want to finish it, 
and make some more videos on it. But yeah, I think I'm going to go for now, and well, thanks for watching, and I'll be back later with another video.